Hello. Uh, so let's say we want to do a install cool prop. Uh, I was noticing that uh, I'm not able to really uh, like download. I mean, after doing the download, I'm not able to install it. So this video is more regarding that. Uh, how to install uh, cool prop so let's say uh, i think i got uh, one of the best way to do the uh, like installation is uh, let's say you are into this search source forge cool prop uh, this is the latest version then uh, we'll go for installers and windows and then there will be this exe file uh, so we'll just do a download of this and and this will appear into my downloads so yeah so i yeah so so this is into my downloads uh, the latest one is oh. so this is into my downloads and let's say i do a run and i run anyway and then mine is a uh, 64 bit with uh, you know 64 bit so i'm just doing this one uh, install it as a 64 bit and finish now you'll notice it will take some time and then this will get uh, the the test excel file will appear in over here but it will take some time it will not happen like right away so so we we just have to be like little patient on that actually sorry it already came over here so now let's say i click open the excel file and let's say i go into the add-ins i check the add-in so add-in is already here it's all you know there but uh, and i've also like enabled over here into the trust center uh, so so in the trust center i have this uh, new location like uh, you know already there so as to you know that this is a trusted one and add-ins uh and then under macros i have enabled all the macros so so pretty much there everything is there uh but if i hit control alt control shift and f9 i still get this uh name over here you know the like hash name question mark so how do i come out of this error so what i did is uh, what we have to do is i have to press uh, this i have to go into basically vba so i'm pressing alt f11 now you will notice here that okay there is a uh, so i have to go into tools reference and then I have to browse. I have to first of all check the in tools. I have to check the references as cool prop. Is it there or not? So I'm looking for CO like COO. Okay. I don't see a cool prop 
over here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, like it's an XLA file open. Click OK. Uh, before I do that, I have to make sure that in the options when I'm going into the add-ins uh, I have to uncheck the cool prop add-in okay and I'm going to just save it now now I'll go into the uh, visual basic I'll go with the the references and I'll do a browse I'll say Microsoft Excel files and I'll select this one uh, what I typically do is whatever is the 25 KB file is what I'm going to it's mainly the XLA file so I just use that and press OK save it press OK and now when I go come back on the Excel file and I press Alt Control Shift and F9 I get these numbers so I'm not getting any more those uh, you know hash name so I found this as a useful way of uh, installing the cool prop uh, thank you